Okay, so now it looks like I'm live. Okay, well, hi there, I'm AV. I've tried to stream before a few times, but I always fell off. I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna try and do like Tuesdays and Thursdays, depending on my mood. Uh, just for an hour right now, and apologies for this shitty audio. Um, I'm doing it through Xbox, so we're kind of stuck with this one second delay. Nothing I can really do about that, but the game I wanted to start on is Kingdoms. I really love it. I think it's an amazing game. Um, I feel like it doesn't get a lot of... Uh, it's just not like a big falling for it for some reason, but it's amazing. So that's the game I want to work with. I'm also playing it right now, but I'm going to do a new game. And hopefully I stick with it and I don't change my mind later like I did on my other streams. <laughs> Um, all right. From the beginning, we were wrong. And only now, well into the second decade of the conflict, have we begun to understand the mistakes we have made. We lived in harmony among the Fae, in a world awakened to new magic. Perhaps we should have foreseen what might be born on this rising tide. What force might awaken. A force powerful enough to twist even the eternal and the mutable faithful. <laughs> but Gadflow, the new king of the Winter Court, surprised us all. Singular among his people, he was all that other Fae were not. Aggressive, ambitious, visionary. He had power like none we had ever seen. Terrible and deadly. Gadflo and his followers, the Tuatha Deon, believed that a new god was to be born in the east, beneath Gadflo's crystalline fortress of Amethyn. In the name of that god, they marched to war against the young races of Amalur. Against a mortal army, no matter the power of their god, we might have been victorious, but the Fae are creatures of magic, not bound by the laws of life and death. Each two eyes are fallen on the battlefield would soon rise again, for the Fae do not know death as we do. How could we stand against such a force? For ten years the war raged, for ten years the armies of men and Alpha fought and died, but as our numbers dwindled, we knew that it was only a matter of time. Our fate had been written. At least, that is what we believed. Until you died. So I really don't like to talk through cutscenes. What do you think this one is that? How far? Got on? Could even be a Jotun. Always a surprise, eh, Grant? Eyes on the job, boy. Don't matter what it is. Dead's dead. And be thankful for that. All we've seen. Go on and pull back the sheet, though. It'll need to be in our report, one way or the other. Okay, now I finally get to name my character. Alright, let's see... These bonuses kind of don't really matter, except for like, beginning game, because you can pretty much max out all your skills. Um... I like to start out with 
I think lock picking and detected in are like the most helpful. Maybe even dispelling. Stealth is okay, I guess. I'm going to go with um I think detect hidden is probably the most important one because that lets you see things like hidden doors and stuff. So I guess I'm going to be this guy. I always play more as like a rogue type character in, in most games, um, so I like critical hit and stuff like that. I'm probably going to go with that because the experience bonus is 1% who gives a, sh a crap. <laughs> I don't know if I should be cursed here. <laughs> I'll do whatever I want. Um, yeah, I don't care. Uh, <laughs> so I don't care about the experience bonus because it's so tiny. And you can find like rings or stuff in the game that will give you bonuses and honestly it's really not going to matter in the long run. Fire damage is cool, I guess. I'm just going to go with death. I, I like the uh, critical hit damage. Okay, presets. None of them are really that good, uh, but that's okay. Okay. okay, I guess. Oh, cool. It looks the most like me. Maybe that one. I don't know. I'm pale like a ghost, so that's probably pretty accurate for me. Can I zoom in? Nope. Cool. Awesome. Perfect. That screen is hard to see. That dude. Oh. I don't know. It's double? Oh, sh let me change that hair. That's terrible. I have no hair. Bald. And my facial hair options are slim. Great. Guess this is it. Okay. Like bright red. It's not quite. Eyebrow color? I can't even see that. Oh my god, I got a little jewelry on there. Get rid of that. Any cool tattoos? Not really? It's kind of cool. I'll do that one. Sure, how I feel about that tattoo color. I don't know what the fuck that is. Okay. Back to face. Any cool stuff? It's double color. That actually changes that color. Okay, so I should make it like that, I guess, for red. It's hard to see. Let's go with that, because I think that's red. Oh, intensity. Anyways, the character creation, okay, it's not the best, but the game is really, really fun, and it, I don't think it matters too much. I guess I'll go with that. I don't know, man, I hate that tattoo. something a 
that's like the only option. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's the one. I think his eyes. I was trying to make them green. I feel like the, that green. Maybe that's it. Okay. Accessories. I don't care about them. It's the best I could do. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Anyways. Oh, I don't get to name me. Must have been a oh shit! Did I fuck up? The war. I could have told him how he'd end up. Not in bad shape though, all things considered. All right then. Make sure it goes into the report. You know he'll want all the details. Amazing how well the body held up. Better than I've seen. I'm just glad it's not moving. Must have been born under a lucky star, this one. Anything else we need? Unless you'd like to name him, I think we're done. Oh, okay, good. Put him with the others. Yay. I don't know if you can see this on your end, but I am naming my little boy that I've just created. My name, of course. Yeah, that's my name. Well, that's it for you then. Better luck next time. Just get off. Oh yeah. We have the exact same physique. This is perfect. Who's on? All right. Anyways. I'm in. Okay. But yeah, so this is like one of my fa like my favorite games are definitely the Elder Scrolls of course, Skyrim, Oblivion. But this game was actually designed by the same guy who designed Marwin and Oblivion. So there's actually like a lot of similarities in it. much of a reader I, like I read stuff in the games but like it depends I've also played this game a lot of times so I'll try and still let you read it if you'd like um, I, I kind of skims this guy uh, from Morris Hughes he's kind of a character in the game so you kind of want to pay attention to the stuff that he leaves you but I know I'm not gonna make some mistakes. I'm currently like almost done with the game on my main character, um, but I've I made some mistakes. So I don't mind being able to restart. It's uh, necessary for me to have done what I just did. Yeah, like there's some things I messed up on. Like you shouldn't read any skill books because there's actually a way through normal leveling up and through using trainers that you can actually max out all skills uh, if you do the skill books last. Um, and I fucked up. I did not do that. Also, I really just wanted to make a character that kind of looked like me, even though it's kind of impossible. In this game, what's in there? They're all over. Run! 
I also just really like this game, and I kind of just want to share it, even if it's to just this one person who's watching right now. <laughs> but after this, I'll be uploading it to my YouTube, so... Yeah, we'll see. Oh, why can't I? I have to quit my, my little sword. I don't like these. So I'll be switching to Fayblades or Daggers as soon as I get the chance. I can't sneak yet. Oh, I like sneaking. Okay. Stay away. I don't know, there's some like charm about this game that I just really like. It's it's very arcadey, like it feels very casual and simple and easy to pick up, easy to play. Help anybody! Still has a lot of depth. You has a lot of lore. Please help me! Please scum! No. Kind of a test too right now to see if like I already know I have an audio issue with like a second delay every time I talk with my video. That's just because I'm on Xbox. Thank you. I have to eventually set it up so I can do it through my computer. Wait. I've seen you before. On the slab. You you were dead. It worked. By the tome it worked. You're alive! Uh, well, um, you died. I don't know how or even where, but your body was remade in the Well of Souls and somehow it worked. The Well restored your soul to your body and it worked. We must get you to Professor Hughes right away. He'll have questions for you. Oh my, you don't know? Perhaps the process damaged your memory. They are the Tawatha Deon, the enemies of all the young races. We've never seen them this far inland. Not even during the invasion. I, I don't know why they are here. Hughes may have the answer to that as well. You must stay alive and reach him. Professor Formerus Hughes, the Well of Souls is his life's work. The Tawatha are coming into the lower levels. If we hurry, we should be able to beat them to the top. Take these. They'll help keep you safe long enough to get to Hughes. Now, let's get going! He'll be in his study on the ground floor of the tower. At least, I hope he's there. And safe. Mm -hmm. Let me get this door, and we can be on our way. Right this way. Uh, you I gotta pick go up this stuff now. My main character has such a habit of just kind of junking everything I find, but everything matters now. Yeah, so I'm gonna wear these. Right now, wear these. Junk those. Cool. Alright. That I'm going to map to here. It's just a thing. Keep all the notes so that I get. That guy died a horrible death. Um. I don't know why I do I just always do that. And even in Skyrim, I save every book that I find. Shall I bring it to my house and find out I already have like 15 copies of it? I don't know how to get out of here and I wasn't listening. Up. Okay. It's obvious. <laughs> Yo. Your name. 
that you're still groggy, but just keep move. 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 We can't go back up that. So he he definitely told me where to go, and I wasn't paying attention. Not that. Okay. I'm dumb right now, but I'll figure it out. This is what they're after. Okay. It's, it's right here in my face. Souls. Imagine an end to war. An end to death. If you can find anything useful. I don't know. I just love this game. It's a little corny sometimes and it's a little dated. But I like this on. Wait! Do you hear something? Almost full armor, we're just missing a little head. My favorite weapons are the uh, our fade blades and what are they called? Chakrams. Mine. That's like a super easy to use interface. Um, like. The loot system is really nice, and I can just press Y on things to just junk them right away when I find them. And there's a lot of games I, I wish I had. I keep wanting to do powers that I don't have right now. That one had a bow. Oh, now I have a bow. And that's your secondary weapon. Or this can be my secondary weapon. I don't like bows really, but I do in other games. But the shotguns are so good, I I'd rather use those. But I will use this for now. Starting all over, but I think we can do it. Can't sneak. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot about combos. This is better than what I have. I think you always gotta take into consideration with what it is that you're trying to do. Like, that's melee block, and this one gives me more critical hit damage, and the difference is just two defense, so I don't care. I probably should have kept those. Let me look at those boots that I threw away. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep the other things. I'm always, I always build my characters to be more of a uh, glass cannon. Oh great! You. Oh, 
ekonomi uh, kanan mark yeah, goodbye and spam you and hell okay sorry about that someone was trying to sell me some stuff and the one person that might have been viewing <laughs> Whatever. I just had to block them. Okay. Cankers are deadly if you catch an enemy unaware. Their speed more than makes up for their size. Okay, can we look at the map yet? Oh, cool. Yeah, awesome. If you can sneak up on them with your daggers, you should be able to Oh good, now I can sneak. Quietly. I don't have daggers. Did I pick up daggers and I missed it? Oh I did. Oh. Can't add that to junk. Maybe they don't let you junk necessary things like that in the early game because it's kind of like a tutorial. Anyways, let's kill this dude. First custom for when you I'll see that later game. You just assassinate. Let's see if I can get one of these before the other guy notices. That a mistake of the This is where we learn magic. Only respond in the presence of magic. Perhaps there is more to you than it seems. Oh, there is. Oh man, did I forget to take that note at the beginning? I have to collect all that stuff. Uh, what is that? That is poison. I don't care. I honestly never use these, so I'm gonna chunk that too. I really only keep health potions and like a handful of other stuff. Okay. What's that little white dot on my? Oh, it's a um, NPC that I can't interact with. the other thing I really love the compass in this game um, when you level up your detect hidden it'll show you like all things that you can interact with on the map like treasure loot whatever and you know sometimes I want that like immersive figured out on my own experience and sometimes I just like to play a game like this where I can it's like more arcade and I can just play okay moving on I'll be fine. There we go. Oh, I do have a spell already. Awesome. It completely covered the tunnel. That. Maybe you can use that staff to burn a path through. Yes, I could if I have to. Probably better than that bow, anyways. Spiders burn them, burn them. It's kind of cool. I don't really use staffs normally, but um, I like the combo. Cool. 
just junking all that stuff. Nothing important there for me. Almost jumped to that health. Hurry, get out of here. I love just breaking crates and getting coins from it. It's Make sure I have my the same settings on. I'm just making sure that I have the same stuff I had set on or set up as before. Like I don't want to accidentally kill um as Oh, I've never now. seen that bug before. This That's some creepy is where we stuff. Take whatever you want from this armory. We might have a few things that would fit you. Just make sure you get to choose. We can hold off the two offer here. Okay. Um. There's nothing more I can do except ooh. to stay here and slap. But this is the. With luck, I'll see you on the outside. Damn. I'll okay. See you on the outside. I sure hope you will. It will say, huh? Ah. Late armor. Nothing protects quite like layers of impervious leather armor. And what I have already got this. Daggers, same as what I have. Do you need this lock fix though? But we'll give you the simple oh, why did I? Need... Oh, I could have junked that stuff. I need all the money I can get right now. That's my junk weapons in here. Souls. Cool. All right, let's move. Your return from the dead? Please forgive me. You must be terribly confused by all of this. I am Fomorous Hughes, and this is my laboratory at Alastar. Everything you see here is dedicated to one thing. The Well of Souls. The pursuit of immortality. And you, you're my first success. If we only had the time, there's so much we might learn from one another. Too much to explain right now. The Tuatha have come to stop my work, but I don't believe they know about you. Not yet. What's important is getting you out of here safely. You're the only proof of what we've achieved here. I may not be able to save the well, but I can ensure that its only success is safe. Yes, yes, you're right. I, I've got my notes, but it's most important that you stay safe. It's just that you... 
You're... Wait, Fascinating. Simply astounding. I'm not certain what's caused it, but somehow... Yeah. Yes, as I was saying, I'm not sure what... Perhaps I should go see. Sir, sir, Mr. Hughes, the dwarf have reached the lab. That inside the lab. Oh, ah. rip. Okay. No, we've got to get you out of here now, quickly. Follow the path to the town of Gorhart. Find Agar. He's a friend, and he may be able to help. No matter what else, stay alive. <laughs> Hey, love the music. Is there anything else I could loot before I go? Junk that. I forgot I have a spell I can cast. I'll try it. My super cool ability yet, I guess. Far away. Get and before I forget, in my junk, I accidentally put health potion. No, I didn't. Oh, but we did just get a little ring for that. Okay. all my abilities on my other character <laughs> but we'll get there I want my detect hidden up at least to this This is so important too, but this one for now. 
And I always like to do... Well, so you start out with a point in uh, things. Hmm. Great. I don't want to do that. Over here, I would like to have this for daggers and fey blades. I like to do, um, I'll get to that in a second, but I do, you can do your own build however you want, like in each category or like sorcery and finesse or whatever, but I like to do jack of all trades. So every level up, I do one in each thing. I really like chakrams, so we're gonna get that. And this one, I usually do that for some reason. No, I like never block. I do like to use that though. A lot. We're gonna have to go see. Um, we have to respect already because I have points and things that I don't want. That's just how it is. Now I do need to, I'm gonna map that to good. That's where I want it. I usually prefer talismans. They're uh, shields that also block elements. I don't really use shields that much, but when I do, it's usually to block against like spells and stuff. So I'm probably gonna use that instead. Can I um, scrap this now. Okay, cool. Usually, like, when I go into a new zone, I like to explore all the areas first, do all the side quests first, then faction, and then main quests. A little limited on what I can explore right now because my detect hidden is so low. to dispel right now. Can I force it? Oh, 90% chance. Okay, good. All right, better daggers already. That's awesome. Yeah, so I just junked the old ones. Scepter is really? I don't think I've ever used one. I guess it's like a short range staff? I really don't know. Just looking for loot. Okay. 
trying to collect all the plants that I can on the way. Those are important. Remember you. You're. You're the one. How did you come back? How did you find me here? What are you when doing? I saw you with Ensel in the well, I ran. But it wasn't because I was afraid. I was coming to report that Hughes's experiment had succeeded. The Well of Souls is bigger than just one gnome's pet project. My contact pays well for information about its progress. I just send reports to make some money on the side. But I don't know how the Tawatha found out. This has nothing to do with them. I never wanted anyone to get hurt. I never meant for anyone to get hurt. God damn it. No, I don't want to kill this dude. I'm sorry. God damn it. Far back, I have to go. Whoops. <laughs> this is why you save. Fuck me. Oh, I'm that far back. <laughs> oh, no. what it is man you need to learn to save and save often otherwise suffer the consequences suffer. no not really no big deal I barely lost any progress. I'm gonna choose the same things I did last time. Actually, except this time I'm gonna put one into this. Put one there. Get rid of the weapons, get rid of the sword, get rid of the bow. gotta save before you do dialogue with people just in case there's a speech check so you can pass it or save scum until you do <sighs> if it took me that long to save that's so 
terrible. Okay. My luck is this time. Ah, <laughs> a crafting component. And let's save. We don't have that many lock picks, so let's start being smart. Uh, I like the name, but I mean, I guess it's better than what I have. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Okay, so some better stuff, some worse stuff. Not so bad. And Darius will switch to oh, what's a scepter? Oh, we can't even wield it. Oh, goodbye then. I'll just scrap you. I don't really care. I'm hoping to get chakrams like super soon, or make them myself. Have it. Uh, must be an Easter egg or something. I've never noticed this before. Come at me, I'm gonna save right now. <laughs> okay. Because we're gonna you. try and pass that. I remember you. When I stood with a salt, my contact pays well. But oh. I don't know how the Tawatha found out. Aye, this has nothing to do with them. I never wanted anyone to get hurt. I never meant for anyone to get hurt. But at this point. We're gonna have the result that we want. But I want. Sorry. Uh, sorry. You. I remember you when yeah. I saw the weather of so my con. But I don't know how the Tawatha found out. I never meant for anyone to get hurt. Mm. See how many times it takes before I just give up. <laughs> Another benefit about it being an old game is the load times are like you. seconds. I remember you. When I the weather my con, but I don't know how the Tawatha found out. I never meant for anyone to get. Keep failing, and you are gonna get hurt. You, I remember you when I the weather my con, but I don't know how the Tawatha found out. I never meant for anyone to get. Damn it. Okay, let's keep trying. You, I remember when I, I think it gives me XP by cold, passing the. the if I remember right, this has nothing to I only have a five percent chance. That's why I keep failing it. I might just give up on that. This is the last time. I'll try it one more time, and then I'm just gonna not worry about it. You. I remember when I, I the know, weather my cop, but I don't know how the Tawatha found out. I never meant for anyone to. All right. Okay. Well, we won't try and cheat him out of money. 
You. I remember when I the weather of my cop, but I don't know how the Tawath have found out. This has nothing to do with hey. them. I never wanted anyone to get hurt. I never meant for anyone to- Okay, last time. <laughs> I remember you when I st the weather out of my here. Cop, but I don't know how the Tawatha found out. Thank you, thank you. I don't want. It gives you money, anyways. <laughs> I'll be able to come back here later. <laughs> I know there's like a detect hidden spot somewhere that I can't see. I don't know if I can even see it on my map yet. Without that, I can't remember. I think there is a quest that will take me to that dungeon, so I'm not going to try and go to it now. Just want to want to discover it. He's not. He can't discover anything right now. He just sucks. Okay. It's seven, so I was only going to stream six or seven, but I would like at least to get to the town, um, and then I'll I'll stop there. You've come from the tower, haven't you? Name's Agarth. Maybe you can help an old Fate Weaver, eh? Fate Weavers look at the great tapestry of fate. The threads will tell us how a life will unfold. But knowing the future and being able to change it are two very different things. Did he? Poor old Fomerus Hughes. He respected the way the world works. What a shame. He's probably dead by now. When he started his experiments here, he asked me if they'd ever be successful. The cards told me that the Well of Souls would work, but its success would come on the day that Hughes was to die. The old man took it pretty well, honestly, although we did a lot of drinking after that. I didn't say before I talked to him, did I? I wish I could, but times are tough. I've barely got enough to pay my bar tabs as it is. That's fair. You really don't know much, do you? A fate weaver taps into the threads of fate and channels that energy through a focus. My order prefers cards. The cards are unique to each fate weaver, since we all see the weave differently. You. You're the one. Then that means... It all makes sense now. The cards this morning. I drew the Gravedigger, the Running Man, and the Beast. Prepare yourself. They're coming. Oh, I can do that already? Is this the right time for that? I guess this is Garth's for doing it. 
I usually like to get their health low before I jump right into this, but... of fate I've seen them before but I've never seen anyone manipulate them like that you just changed how the world was supposed to work how did you do that you just fate is the will of the gods no mortal should be able to change it how is that even possible come here I'm going to do a reading you might be able to change the threats, but fate will still have a plan for you. I promise not to tell you if I see your death. It's a gift. Some people paint landscapes, other people write poetry. I peer into the weave of fate's tapestry and see people's deaths. That would be my guess. He was an academic, but he had a proper respect for fate's plan. Unlike most gnomes. You're nervous. Relax. This is what fate weavers do. I'll be seeing your place in the pattern of destiny. Who you are, what you've done, where your path takes you. Or, at least, I should be. You're real, right? I swear I haven't had that much... <laughs> Fate's weave is always hard to see. It's in motion, hard to make out, but undeniably there. Yours is just... missing. This doesn't make sense. All mortal creatures have a place in the pattern. You should have one too, dead or not. If this is true, and I'm not saying I believe it, then your path is yours to determine. Yay. I don't think I can do... Is that the one? Yeah, yeah. That's one that. So, here's the destinies. That's like one of my favorite things about this game. There's like one for each main thing like you would see in most games. You know, your mage, rogue, knight, whatever. And then you have combos of two. And then you have my favorite, which is one of each. It does mean that you will be a little less powerful in each category. category. Excuse me. Um, and there's also some benefits that the cards give you. Like this one, Ice Blink and stuff. But the huge cool thing is these also give you skills. Like this first one doesn't do anything, but the second one I can get when I get four in each level, I can get plus one to all my skills. And the one I'm actually going to be aiming for is this one. The bottom one gives me plus three. Which is pretty cool, and I can't wait. Right, this is what I am on my current playthrough. But I guess I'm starting all over, so... Anyway... I can see the threads around you, but they're shifting, changing so rapidly, I can't make sense of them. Normally, the threads would guide my hand to the cards, and I'd use those cards to see your pattern in the weave. But it just didn't happen. They wouldn't focus. So either there's something wrong with me, and there isn't, or there's mm. something very wrong with you. I would like that confidence. It could mean nothing, or it could mean everything. The world is changing. You might be a sign of that, or maybe the cause. I've never had a reason to doubt my own readings, but we should consult with Arden. He's not a mm -hmm. friend, but he's got a good eye for the tapestry. I'll meet you at his home to the east. I'm going to see if I can be of any help to the wounded at the tower. Okay. What could this all mean? I'm gonna try and get to the first town and then I'll wrap up. I 
the future I might do more than one hour, but for now, because I'm just starting, um, and I don't want to overwhelm myself, so right now I'm only going to do six to seven on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And my plan is on Tuesdays, I would like to do... It depends. I might be so into kingdoms that I might just want to do kingdoms. But um, right now I want to do... Or the, my idea was Tuesdays I'll do... Um, like something creative like maybe building in the sims because i like to do that or and then thursdays i'll do playthroughs but i might just want to do kingdoms right now <laughs> we'll see of all the songs in halls of lore there echoes none more grand than olaine's many feats of might the pure and lady of the light she is a knight of golden nut. She is the cure seeker, the conscience of the summer fay. She is the heart of spring, of day. I really like that. So, peppered throughout the map, um, there are lore stones that give you, like, they're basically audio diaries that give you some background of, like, the area you're in or some characters. Um, and it's just a fun little game. Just really like it. I think it's very pretty. Just feels super fancy. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this isn't hope that didn't mess the stream up. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. Um, I think this is go for it. Everyone just stand yeah. back. The warden can't work when you're crowding so close. Go back to your business. Go yes. on. What is it? Oh. Thoru have mercy. Oh. I don't care what you race. It's a tragedy whenever anyone's savage like this. Oh. Just look at the poor creature. She's been beaten to the brink of death. Oh. The Fae may be strange, but they oh. certainly don't deserve this. It appears she was attacked with some oh. manner of short blade. Likely a dagger, although there's no way I can be sure. People simply stood by as she called for help. No one lifted a finger. Can you imagine? It's shameful to treat another in such a way, even if she is a fae. I don't know whether we possess the Passive knowledge to treat such there. a wound. Frankly, I don't even know if I could save a mortal with such grievous wounds. I'd like to help. Well, you're the only one. With all the troubles we've suffered in this village, people are weary of adversity. They'd rather just ignore it. I'm going to suggest something a bit... Uh, untraditional. There's a fae named Eri. She spends her days up on the hill overlooking the village. Seek her wisdom. I would do it, but... I am a coward. That's the truth. Oh. Hey. Perhaps a fae will know how to heal a fae. If not, then we're back where we started. To be upfront about that kind of Bye thing. Now. Okay. We're in the first town. Yay. I want to do some basic stuff real quick. We just got here. I'd like to sell some stuff. Um, buy in. a backpack space if I can. Welcome to Gorehart, the last settlement before the Feylands. How can I fill your pack today? So, it, you always want to check every shop that you come across. Because some of them have a backpack. And it'll increase your backpack space. I don't have enough money. Still don't after selling stuff. So, she's going to be on my list. Goodbye. I'll be back. <laughs> Yeah, they don't mind when I do that kind of stuff for some reason. Um, I don't want to keep playing, but uh. I want to stick to my six to seven for now. So it's not like a big commitment yet. Uh. This is a chest. I think it's better to wait to open this chest until later. Of Saint Odwigs. Only oh, when they fall quest. to earth will they realize they are not above us. 
Well, I'm going to go ahead and save and quit for now. Um, before I get carried away, because I could easily play another hour. Okay. So, again, my plan is I'm going to try to stream every Tuesday and Thursday, 6 to 7. And it might be um, creative stuff on Tuesdays, playthroughs on Thursdays. It might just be playthroughs. And this is also really new. I know that my audio sucks. Right now I have like a delay every time I talk, like that dog from Kung Pao. So that's just how it is. But um, I'm just happy to be able to share this, something I really love. And that's all that matters. So thank you for watching.